hello guys and welcome back to my channel today was dedicated to doing a bunch of tasks around my house first i'm going to share with you my parcels so i've got delivery from amazon i've ordered my kettle my three in one waffle maker as well and i'm going to share with you quick waffle maker recipe that you and your kids will love that also i'm going to share with you how i will organize my children's uniform before they will start their school last but not the least i have also organized my bathroom cupboard so let's get started i just got back from my weekly food shop so this is my third week i have been doing grocery shopping at seven o'clock in the morning it might sound to you a little bit crazy but i'm a morning person and i love to do my jobs in the morning and morning grocery runs are so therapeutic and i don't know why but it's so calm and peaceful so if you never ever try doing morning shopping so just go once in the morning you will love it especially if you are a parent and my children this time if you see in my morning routine you know my morning routines are very calm my children usually because it's summer holidays they are sleeping so it's it's the best time for me to go and do my morning shopping i've got some food to make easy meal for this week because it's gonna be hectic i'm going away as well for weekend so in total i've spent 172 pounds so with discount i paid 151 something like that in tesco i really Really like it when you use a club card and you get loads of discount as well i typically do my grocery just once a week i love doing groceries and shopping i spent two hours in the tesco this morning i can do shopping all day but the worst part i think that i struggle is how to put everything back in the right place especially um because my kitchen is not that big and it's really hard to put everything away I'm just drinking my juice and that's what I was thinking that do I really need all this stuff but when you have a children family to be honest is nothing I just want to tell you one more thing never go for a shopping when you are hungry because I don't eat morning breakfast I think I was hungry as well and I've got loads of snacks morning treats like croissants some cupcakes a lot and also i want to share with you at tesco i've got this peri peri whole chicken that i really really want to try it and i will show you when i will make it not in this video i think in the next week i will make it and i will share with you i've also got these meat smosas they are really nice and they were on the club card discount as well there were loads of offers usually when i go with my children honestly i don't really see all those offers and anything because it was so calm so peaceful it was like no it was not busy so i went through each and every offer and i was doing a proper peaceful shopping some of the stuff you see here we are not gonna eat like all this in one week it's actually just a stock up for my cupboard and we also doing loads of picnics and going out that is why i've got loads of snacks also i found my favorite rice brand last time when i went to tesco um, i think i bought the wrong one so it wasn't right for us my children didn't like the taste i didn't like it so i've got koi nur banaspati rice and they're really nice for plow or biryani or just a simple rice and now i'm just putting all the cupcakes away and then I was really tired at this point but I wanted to finish all these jobs in the morning so then after that I can sit down so I've got some parcels that I'm gonna share with you also I've got this dress from Tesco more than color than anything I think I like the material it was 27 pound but it was on the sale so I've just got from 8 pound and it was my size as well so it made my morning so I'm gonna quickly go upstairs and get ready this dress is so comfy and I love the material um, let's open my parcels the first parcel that I'm gonna share with you my makeup I've got my blush on and also I've got lip gloss I was I'm always hunt for blush on and lip gloss is the two thing that I use daily I've also got this cute bag from Ted Baker so if you're looking for a nice bag like if you're a mom you go for a picnic and stuff it's, um, it's 
adding the full price is on 40 pound but it was on the sale so i've got the half price and um, i think these kind of bags i really like when i go out with my children for picnics or just like cinema strip so you can just put everything in there and they're very useful the next shopping that i'm going to share with you is my zara's jean trousers that this is the style i was looking for so it was 32 pound but and i've got on the sale for five pound 99 can you believe that so the reason what i'm sharing with you is always go for a shopping to different shops different brands and you always get loads of discounts and different styles as well now let's open these two parcels that i received this morning the first i'm going to share with you this is bravel cattle it is one cup at a time cattle so the idea is that is energy saving i heard loads of really good reviews about that so i bought this cattle if you're new here you might don't know but this is my new house so i'm always hunting for new things and i'm buying new things from my house I just want to give you one tip if you just recently moved to a new house or are you looking for a new house don't buy anything in rush take your time settle in your house and then buy things slowly slowly it will make more sense to you and it will make your life much more easier so now the second thing i'm going to open is my waffle maker three in one so it has a waffle maker tray also panini maker and a sandwich maker my kitchen is really small so i always look for things that are easy to store and take less space on the counter so now let's put all the shopping away and let's go for the next part of the video so first i'm going to share with you the quick and easy waffle maker recipe that you can make anytime with your children at home first i'm going to make a space for my kettle and um, i'm not really sure where to put that Um, I think I'm going to put next to my juicer. The reason why I've got juicer all the time outside is just it's a reminder for me every day that I need to make a juice. If I put inside in the cupboard, believe me, I'm not going to do that. So now I'm going to make a quick waffle recipe with you. And worse better than making homemade waffles on the morning. First, we're going to put all the dry ingredients together. One cup of flour. 2 tablespoon of sugar, 1 teaspoon of baking powder, 2 tablespoon of butter, 2 eggs and 1 teaspoon of vanilla essence and also I've got 1 cup of milk. So I am putting everything together in one bowl. You can do it, I've seen different recipes people put dry ingredients in a different side and put the wet ingredients in different side but I just try to make my life easy and I'm just doing in a one bowl so I'm just going to whisk everything together and I've just made the waffle better I'm just turn my waffle maker on it's such an easy recipe that you can make with your children as well. I pour a lot of batter in because we like thick waffles, but you can go ahead and do whatever you like. It's yours. The best part of doing cooking at home and making things is you can cook the way you like and you can add whichever ingredients you like and you can skip whichever ingredients that you don't like. For topping, I'm using Nutella and strawberries. So waffles are ready. Let me show you how good they look. The other benefit of doing cooking at home is more cheaper and I believe is more healthier as well. When I take my children out for a treat, like when we go for desserts and stuff, these waffles, they sell so expensive and I personally think it's not worth it. Some days are okay if you want to treat yourself or when you are out for a day out. So it's okay to eat from outside, but not like every weekend or every morning when your children wants to eat just a waffle and take them to the fancy restaurants. But try this recipe and I hope you guys will like it. After feeding my children, I will make myself a quick cheese sandwich. So it will be just a simple cheese sandwich. There's nothing special about that. I just want to share with you how easy it is to use this waffle maker machine. Now I'm using a sandwich maker tray. 
so uh, be careful if you're using right away because it was very hot I have used my gloves I'm just gonna get a simple bread and I'm gonna put some cheese inside because I really fancy cheese this morning this sandwich maker also has a panini maker tray as well so it's three in one waffle maker sandwich maker and a panini maker I also put some chips on the side as well I'm gonna use my kettle first time it makes one cup of coffee or tea at a time if you need more you need to press multiple times obviously it's energy saving and it only just heats the amount of water that you need while i was doing the voiceover i was just thinking how much i paid for this kettle and waffle maker roughly i do know but i don't really know the exact price but if you just want to know let me know in the comments i will find the price for you um yes so my breakfast is ready i'm just gonna have my breakfast and i will go upstairs and i need to organize my children cupboards and also today i'm gonna organize my bathroom cupboard so my house was tidy from upstairs i just did a quick tidy up this morning i didn't film it because um, it takes a lot of time when I do filming so I decided to do a quick tidy up and I'm just going to show you the important jobs that I did today. So now let's um, organize my children's cupboards. This is my daughter's room. So last night they were not home so I had a time. So quickly I uh, took loads of clothes out from the cupboard that they really don't need it or they just grow out of it. I'm just sharing with you my quick tips that I do in my home and that will make my morning easy when my children will start school next week. If you have everything organized in children's room and everything's on the right place, it just makes children's life and your life so much easy. I'm putting my daughter's uniform in these cupboards here so it's just easy for them to reach and take it out and get ready independently in the morning. Now I'm going to my son's room and I'm going to organize his cupboard as well. So when it's school week next week so it's just it will be easy for me and for them as well. So let's organize my son's cupboard. He has a really small cupboard but I got these dividers from IKEA I think a long time ago and um, I've just put all his shirts and his trousers in each divider so every day he has a one shirt and a trouser for every day it's just he takes it out and get ready in the morning also I'm putting his joggers on the side as well and on hoodies on the other side so after school when they're gonna come back it's just easy for him to find things so his cupboard is done as well this is my bathroom cupboard and it's an absolute disaster and in my defense my cupboard doesn't have loads of dividers and drawers so it's really hard for me to organize and save everything in that one huge cupboard that's why everything ends up on top of each other which i hate it but it's just a reality i've bought the small storage basket to organize my cupboard i started by clearing everything off the top so that i can wipe down the surface uh, very deeply it had so much built up makeup and was unbelievable you can't really see it but i promise you it was there my original plan was to organize and clear off everything but it was nearly dinner time um, in my house so i have to do as quick as possible i did my best and the goal is better not perfect and this is what it looks like now it is much better than before everything is on the right place this is what i needed quickly i'm going to share with you what did i cook for dinner so you can get some idea as well so i made a uh, homemade veggies uh, also i made um, the chicken wings with the honey sauce these are my favorite and my children they really loved as well i also got some papadons some for putting i made children some jelly so the dinner is ready thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for spending your time on my channel bye bye for now stay happy stay connected and look after yourself